and uh, Paddy, Mellum, and Glenarini. Yeah, my cam. My, I need to change my cam and everything. <laughs> It'll get adjusted later. So, if you missed, I don't know how much of it was caught at the end, but Norwich and Thunder Boys are the new Raw Tag Team Champions. Now, Hilly Bear v. Rosie Rabbit. Okay, let me change my face then a bit. I don't want to look ill. Mm. Ah. Also, my brightness is a little high. So that'll come down. This is auto color, apparently. Hey, little Shrek, how are you doing? Uh, brightness down. Now we're going down pink. Wonderful. I need to change this thing called white balance, which is great. Can make you look really, ugh, really ill. Or warm. I'll go for that. That's pretty much what it looked like before, but with a bit of extra weird brightness. Hey, Flighty. I'm back. Now it's time for one-on-one -on -one Hilly Bear v. Rosie Rabbit. Willie Garcia, thank you so much for the follow. Not vintage yellow anymore. Okay, that's good. I'm happy with that. Oh, damn it. This is going to be annoying for uh, uploading to Twitch. Uh, to YouTube. Now I've got two videos. I'm going to have to download it and stick them together. And, uh, and I'll just do part one and part two, I think. Hilly Bear v. Rosie Rabbit. Oh, again, it's dropping frames again. What's happening with Twitch? The next match is for the women's title. Yeah, that was a clean cut, but it just dropped a few frames there. I don't know what's going on with Twitch. I never drop frames. Hello. Yeah. Uh, Twitch can take in a dump. Introducing from Newport, Wales, Hilly Bear. Mm. Now a drink. Rabbit v Hilly Bear. Rosie, the longest running champion. Held that belt for 140 days, I think. 130 days. Nobody has held their belt longer than Rosie. This will probably be the toughest fight she has ever had against Hilly. Last night, actually, we had a practice. Yeah, last night we had a kind of a preview of this, and Hilly beat Rosie. No Norwegians in this fight. Hilly Bear versus Rosie Rabbit for the Raw Women's Championship. 
the top prize. Introducing first from Newport, Wales, Hilly Per and her opponents, the Texas Rattle Mistress, Rosie Rabbit. Oh yeah, the, I don't mind about the the mic kind of getting lost a bit when the intros in that's fine but it's just hopefully you can hear me now during the actual fights it's meant to sound like it's you know in, in a crowd and i don't know here's it the belt oh hilly versus rosie oh let's go Oh, Rosie straight away. Striking Hilly in the face. A kick to the back of Rosie by Hilly. Hilly the strongest. I think it's Hilly and Frixit, the two strongest female competitors in BBW. As Rosie goes to slam Hilly into the ring. Into the uh, canvas. Could be quite a brutal beat down. <laughs> Hilly's fighting. Rose is fighting back. Uppercut to Hilly. Sends into the ropes. She doesn't want to lose her title. She's undefeated in title fights, is Hilly. Is uh, Rosie. Hello. Marvel, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Oh wow, now a kind of a torture rack for Hilly. Torture rack slam. Hilly's writhing in pain. And gets stomped on her back. Oof. Sends Rosie flat onto her back. And face into the mat. And a roll over, neck, legs, twisted. Hilly is in so much pain. It gives a huge punch to the face of Rosie. Sends her over and Hilly currently dismantling the women's champion. Piece by piece. Going for an early win. Can she get it? No, she got after one. Wow. Hilly really wants that championship. She felt she was unduly beaten in the last match at SummerSlam. And a running net breaker. Running net breaker to Rosie. Is that it? Oh, kick out the last second by Rosie. But Hilly's, Hilly's waiting. Hilly is waiting. Rosie making her way up and flips her over. Rips her back. Oh, is Hilly gonna? Is Rosie gonna tap? Is Rosie gonna tap? No, she rolls over and tries to pin Hilly. Can she get a quick pin? No, kick out for one. Kick to the back of Hilly Bear. And. Rosie going for a after that suplex to Hilly kick out after two. Rosie, what is Rosie got planned for Hilly? Uh oh, got her arm over her shoulder, but this time Hilly's fighting back. Hilly's not done yet. And Oh no, she's not going for the twist in. Running. Oh, running. Net breaker to Rosie. Ah, kicks out after two. <laughs> and an uppercut to Hilly. Rosie will not go out without a fight. Look, bet. And now Rosie's, Rosie's on top. Rosie's in control. 
sends Helene and Lex. Ah, battle net. And a clothesline to Hilly. Another one. Rosie is has had enough of the pasting she was getting from Hilly. And is not going to give up. She's not going to stop her record-breaking title defense. She doesn't want that to end. And she's covering Hilly after that suplex. Kick out after two. Oh, Rosie's full of confidence. Just waiting for Hilly to get up. And oh, Hilly dodges it. Hilly dodges whatever finishing move Hilly Rose is getting. And now spins her over and tries to rip the neck out of Hilly. Of Rosie. Rosie, is Rosie gonna? No, she's fighting back. Turns, she rolls over Hilly. Two. Ah, kick out after two. Rosie's not happy. And an arm drag to Rosie. Hilly tried to do a slap, but this time, oh! Drop kick to the head of Hilly Bear. Who, again, drops down and kicks her over. And now Hilly getting ready for the running net breaker. Running net breaker to Rosie. As she waits for Rosie to get back up. Oh boy, if this connects. And it does. Ah, she's ripping out Rosie's back. Rosie's next, ripping back. Is she going to hold on? Can she hold on? No, she's tapping out. We've got a new champion. Rosie's title reign has come to an end at the hands of Illiba after 130 something days. Illiba. Defeats Rosie Rabbit. Wow. Hilly was watching last night uh, and real cheering herself on. I'll have to send her a clip of this. Here is your winner and new Royal Women's Champion, Hilly Bell. Send her a snap. Oh. Do you remember where you were when Rosie Rabbit lost her title? She's going to get a rematch though. Tomorrow. As everybody who has defended the title at least once does. If you defend your title successfully once, you get an instant rematch should you lose it. Time for the main event. Paddy, Melum and Glenarini. We've got a brand new entrance for Melum. Gonna be interesting. Yeah, brutal Brenda against. I don't know. Hilly. Hilly's had a buff recently. She's been sub to me for like 13 months. Crazy time, or 12 or 13, maybe more. So she is really high up there. Brenda likes being uh, being being in the ring. That sounds now. Oh. Place your bets now. Melum, Glenarini, and Paddy. Triple threat match for the Raw Championship. Raw Heavyweight Championship. The biggest, the most prestigious title you can win in BBW. <laughs> the wrestling ring, Baltimore. Introducing first the challenger from Oslo, Norway. Glenarini.
Dino wants his title back. <laughs> Brand new entrance for Melon. I haven't seen the rocks in a while, so uh, Melam has stolen his intro. I think it just adds to the. <laughs> I think it works better. <laughs> the glorious Melam Oh. <laughs> Ooh. He's very shiny. Oh no, finger wings. It is. <laughs> it is. Oh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Showing that little spot off to everybody. <laughs> How are you doing, Case Blow? Glenn's looking up like... What's that? <laughs> oh, here he is. Melon's like, come here. The evil one. We need to make Melam into a, yeah, trophy. <laughs> and from Chelsea, England, he is the Raw Heavyweight Champion, Paddy! Had a king of the ring and then at SummerSlam won the title, taking it off uh, Glenarini in a one on one match. It's going to have to defend it again tonight, though. This is technically both Glenarini and Melum's rematch. If Paddy doesn't win tonight, he's not guaranteed a rematch due to the fact that uh, he won't have defended it. Yes. King of being hated by chat. <laughs> Paddy loves being hated by the chat. Paddy loves it. For the Raw Heavyweight Championship. The number one. Belt. So, yeah, I mean, the SmackDown Championship is good, but the Raw one is the. That's the one you want. Glenarini, Melham, scratching his knee. And Paddy. Triple threat, main event, Hell in a Cell for the Championship. Glenarini with a quick suplex to Paddy straight away. Melam's just watching. Probably wise. Oh, and uh, backhand to Glen. Going all in for the attack. Paddy dodged the wave. Melam's attack. Oh no, Paddy. Don't put your hand there. Oh, sends Melam over. Rolling out the ring. Glenn wants revenge on Paddy for taking the title he believes was rightfully his. 
He does have the evil eyebrows. Oh! Melon did a little transporting. Transportation. Oh! Teleporting. That's what I meant. And a leg toss to Glenarini. Glen is angry. It's Glen Mother Fudging Rini, isn't it? A Mother Fudging Glenarini. It's Glen rolls out, and this time Melum smacking Paddy. Oof. Paddy's fighting back with a kick to the head of Melum. And now to the back. Paddy's. Oh, again. The way to get into the. The way to get into the ring uh, seems to be a bit bugged because they seem to just teleport in as a pile driver to Paddy. Narrating, but I couldn't. My voice isn't that good. Oh, DDT to Melum. Is that going to be enough? Quick DDT. No, kick out after one. And Melum with Melum with the first ever Raw champion. I believe. Yeah, then taken over by Glenn. So all three champions and former champions are in the ring now. As Glenn breaks it up. Striking Glenn. Roll him over and a kick to the back. And Paddy's fighting back with the elbow to the head of Melon. What's he got planned? Oh no. I won't put your head there, Paddy. What's he doing? Why is he just holding? Oh, Glenn, uh, Melon's fighting back. Striking Paddy in the head. And now Melon's going for a powerbomb. This time he connects. As Glenn misses the clothesline. And a huge backdrop to Melon again. Don't put your hand there. It will smell later. Stunner! Stunner to Melum. Glenn with a stunner to Melum. Is that going to be enough? No, kick out after two. Oh no. What's Paddy got? Holding Glenn up. Oh, into a spine buster. Reminds me, Melum's pants remind me of that old Chinese proverb. Man who goes to bed with itchy bum wakes up with smelly finger. Sending Melum over top of Paddy. And a spine buster to Melum. Glenn's back in. Oh. Paddy's fighting him off. And double arm suplex. Paddy's just waiting. What's he got in plan for Glenn? Oh, he's going for a jackhammer for a Paddy hammer. Paddy hammer. Oh, connects. Is that going to be enough? Oh, kick out after two. Just in time. I guess Melum was not getting there in time. Yeah. But wasn't in that Sims, didn't Paddy cheat on one of them? As Paddy's going for an ankle lock. Going for an ankle lock on Melum. Can Melum hold on? It's going to take a lot. He's, doing, he's fighting back. He's fighting back. He's twisting. Paddy's leg back. Oh, and he gets out from that. Ooh, can't really stand on his ankle though. And this time Paddy's going for Ooh, twisting suplex. We had the uh, biggest brother, Brenda. And I think Glenn and Melum got married, and then Paddy cheated on, or Glenn cheated on Melum with Paddy or something. I don't know. It was high drama. Close line to Paddy by Glenn. And huge fists to the face of Paddy. Sends Glenn, uh, sends Melum out. Glenn sends Melum lying out. What's, uh, oh, Glenn wants to finish Melum off outside the ring. It's, oh, Melum's fighting back. Melum's fighting back. What's Melum going to do? Oh, he's going to send Glenn in. Oh, no. Don't do it, Melum. Don't do it. 
up top. And, ooh, Glenn dodged it. Glenn dodged it. Is that going to be enough? He's covering Melon. But Paddy breaks up before they even get a one count. Oh, my. What's Glenn doing for Paddy? Pile driver. Pile driver. <laughs> it's Melon and Glenn pounding each other in the ring. And Melham's on the outside again. What's Glenn doing? Oh, sends him over the top rope. And stunner to Melham. Stunner to Melham. And Glenn just huge clothesline. Takes Paddy out. Melham is down. Oh, he's going to try and choke Paddy. Is Melham going to choke Paddy? Can Paddy hold on? Can he hold on? Yes, he can. Glenn is incredibly aggressive, although Paddy, uh, another man who is very aggressive. A spear, spear to Glenn, spear. Mellum trying to get a sneaky, sneaky cover of Glenn. <laughs> what was he doing? In your end hose, <laughs> in your endo. And Paddy just dumps Mellum outside the ring. Like yesterday's trash. Wow, that was a little Melum sneak. That was very Melum. Melum's fighting back outside the ring. He's, uh, this is very even. I have no idea who's going to win this. It really is anyone's to win. Glenn, stunner! Stunner to Melum! Stunner! Glenn covering Melum! Third stunner! Is Glenn going to win it back? No, oh, kick out after two. Wow. Three stunners to Melum. Who? Jawbreaker to Glenn. And going for the strikes to the head of Glenn. Oof. They're making the way up. Oh no, Paddy. Oh, jawbreaker to Paddy. And Melham's going for the ankle lock. Oof, Paddy instantly just went, nope. Elbow to the head, thank you. Paddy's going to try and make... Try and... He has, he has, kind of. Uh-oh. Paddy's got the jackhammer. He's got the jackhammer ready on Glenn. Oh, and connects. Connects. Oh, Paddy. P Paddy pinning Glenn, pinning Melon. And kicks out. But Glenn was pinning Melon at the same, Melon at the same time. Glenn on the outside of the ring. Melum is down. He is down. Oh no, he's moving. He's moving slightly. And Paddy. Well, Melum dodges Paddy. Oh no, what's he doing? Another twisted suplex. Melum. Melum and Glenn, they've got to have zero energy left in them. As Paddy sends Melum into the ring post. But dodges his kick. And this time. Mellum. Oh no, not doing the shoulder. Wow, what is that move? I never seen that before. We call it a stunner. Fourth stunner to Mellum. Fourth stunner to Mellum. He wins. Glenn. <laughs> Holy moly, out of nowhere. Fourth stunner. He did. That was epic match. Evil doesn't win today. Here is your winner and new Raw Heavyweight Champion, Glenna Reedy. I'm going to send him a picture of this.
<laughs> oh yeah. You did it. <laughs> the new So wow, we've got so again. Norway wins again. At Hell in a Cell. Misses it, pricks it, beat Brenda and Flighty Broad. Triple threat match. Jaeger retained his television championship against Andinis. Then a triple threat. Benny B, you missed his friend, Benny B won the Intercontinental Championship. Colton! You want candy, do you? You're in the right spot. Benny B, the new Intercontinental Champion. Viking Game Room beat Astral Fairy in a one-on-one -on -one match for the SmackDown Championship. Then the Thunder Boys beat Mitter, Omoto, Sunshak, and Kippen Bro to become the new and three-time championship. Oh, I can't remember much about it, Colton. Then in that six match, the longest reigning women's championship title reign came to an end. Hilly Bear beating Rosie Rabbit. And in an epic main event, Glenn pinning Melham after four, well, four stunners, a few jackhammers. Finally, Glenn is the new Raw champion. Two time. So right now, let's have a look at uh, what it... Well, we'll go and we'll click next show, even though we're not going to actually start it yet. What is on tomorrow's show? Glenn against Boto. Um, Thunder Boys against Boy Toy Live. Against Friendly Fire, sorry. Uh, triple Threat, Wobble, Suleon, and May. May is making his uh, debut on Raw. Then it's Benny B v Mozlov in an Extreme Rules match. Paddy against Alexander Fro in a ladder match. Starvin is going to do a bit of self-promotion. And Hilly Bear also with some uh, self-promotion. Look at that. Uh, looking at the universe. So let's have a quick look at the belt. So Benny B, like I said, the new one. People have only hold, held it, haven't held it very long. Sunshack is currently in the lead with it, held, holding it for 57 days. Black and Mild 55. Let's see if Benny B can uh, hold on. Uh, Bayleaf. Bayleaf just cannot stop winning. He's on look at 105 days now as the champion. He's won it twice. Uh, Glen Arena. Yeah, no click click play today. Um, I'm going to be doing it in two weeks with Boto and hopefully Dagenmar as well. Uh, normal click click play next week though. And uh, we need to get Flighty in too. Glenn's. Oh gosh, Glenn's a three time champion now. Holding it for 91 days. He's going to hold it for over 100. Three-time champion, Glen Arini. Uh, Viking Game Room wins it. Uh, oh, Baltimore, you held it 49 days. Just two days more than uh, Sean. Uh, Vikings held it for a day. Jaeger. 40, 34 days, he's going to probably be the leader eventually. And we lost frames again. This is, uh, geez, what is wrong with uh, Twitch tonight? Uh, up there, the television championship, and then we've got some of the, the minor ones. Magnus, he has defended it. And he is the uh, still the champion. Yeah, no, I don't know what's wrong. Anyway, it's fine because I'm going to call it a night. Tomorrow, I'm actually streaming in 12 hours, so hopefully Twitch has decided to wake itself up properly and stop doing all this crap. Um, but yeah, thank you very much, guys, for watching. I will upload it. It'll be in two parts. I'm afraid. Uh, hopefully, yeah, I'll be back to normal tomorrow. I'm going to head off. I'm going to send over a host to... I'm going to send a host to a guy who 